for car thefts and break-ins. Right now, Leewood police are searching for a suspect who stole two cars this past weekend in Leewood. The Now KC's Allison Bruner explains this. One was in the drive, one was in the, in the garage itself, and uh, they apparently, whoever the suspect was, from what I've been told, entered the home to get the second set of keys. So technically it's a aggravated burglary since the residents were home. Sergeant Brad Robbins tells me both cases happened Saturday on Pawnee Lane and appear to be random. This putting neighbors on alert. It's very surprising, very shocking. I run around this neighborhood. You think you live in a safe environment, but you always have to keep your eyes open and you know your head on a swivel, as we always told our kids, because you never know what's gonna happen. The Leewood Police Force offering this reminder to neighbors like Barb. Every night before before you go to bed, look outside, make sure your garage doors are closed, make sure the keys are in the house, and make sure there's no valuables sitting out in plain view in the cars. Leewood police tell me in the past 30 days they've contacted more than 100 neighbors in this community asking them to shut their garage doors. An action Barb knows the importance of. Pull the keys and uh, we have a large dog, which is a, a good deterrent, I know. and. Uh, but yeah, just kind of be more cautious and probably be more aware of the neighbors. Local police and neighbors working together to keep this community safe. If you see a vehicle that doesn't belong in your neighborhood that looks out of place, call your local police department. And please still working on a suspect description. If you have any information yourself, please call police. Overall vehicle theft has fallen in the past two decades across the country by a drop of more than 50% according to AAA. All right, turning to weather now.